Hey YouTube, what's up? So, uh, what I did today was, you know, it was, it was really funny. You know, actually, I was feeling really bored today at work. So, um, I took um, like a half day, you know, I, I pretended to be feeling ill. You know, I wasn't actually feeling sick but i uh, you know i just acted like i was feeling sick you know i went to uh, my superior um i just went to her and told her ma'am i'm not feeling so well you know I'm, i really have to go home so can you please let me go home because i'm really not feeling well so she looked at me like you know very like like a funny way you know she, like she thought i was faking she um, you know actually i was faking but you know and her look was so funny i felt like laughing but i somehow controlled myself and i kept the act you know so i kept on saying ma'am really ma'am I'm, I'm really feeling sick today you know please please let me go home um, you can ask my friends you know I've, <laughs> if you don't believe me you can ask my friends you know in the, the you know my colleagues you know there are two two three people who have become my good friends so i told them that i was gonna fake you know, i was gonna fake this shit so uh, so you know they so i told my uh, so i told my superior that if, if you don't believe me you can you can you can ask my friends and uh, yeah so she was like okay okay you can go home uh, but um, you know we go home after like you know two hours you can go home now go home two hours go home after hours so i i told her this um, it would be like i think it was um, i think it was two o'clock okay two o'clock in the afternoon so she told me that go home at four so that's okay because the uh, usual work work time is like from 9 30 in the morning to 6 30 in the evening so she let me go at four so it's okay it was, it was nice you know i wasn't feeling so great today so i i just wanted to come come home you know anyways um, let's talk about something really cool okay you know today i'm not feeling you know that sad or depressed like i was feeling yesterday so you know i want to talk about k juice you know k juice are actually the Japanese term for monsters or big monsters okay like Godzilla Mothra and all that you know like big fucking monsters you know even bigger than the Empire State Building or something you know big monsters destroying the city you know such like such like that you know if just imagine if there could be a you know if there would be a Keiju invasion if there would be some kind of a big mass invasion by some um, you know several cages you know in big cities you know so it would be so cool isn't it yeah it would be it would be really awesome i really want something like that to happen you know a big godzilla like monster you know wrecking havoc you know in the city you know creating chaos everywhere just imagine how it would be like, you know, first of all, you know, my country's government would be, would, you know, our armed forces, you know, my country's armed forces would piss themselves, you know, because when they will realize that all the weapons are like useless against uh, the KJU, uh, okay, then they will be just like, oh my god, you know, then that be, you know, because you know we'll then we'll piss ourselves you know but then you know i i can't talk about the other big powers you know and their big big fucking weapons i can't talk about them but if anything happens in my country our government would just oh my god i'm talking marathi okay it means let's run away let's run away you know oh my god what the hell <laughs> What is this monster? Guy, <laughs> though. Anyways, um, 
anyway so it would be really awesome isn't it if anything of that scale happens you know i'd, I'd be so happy you know it would be really cool to see uh, the monster you know eating other people you know in front of you i wish it won't eat me you know um, I, i know it would be disgusting you know to see the monster eat and kill other people but but still it would be cool you know in cooling that way you know it still would be cool okay to see something like that happen in front of your eyes okay yeah, in real that would be really amazing you know it would be really awesome so just imagine if somehow you get some kind of power by which you could control the kaiju and you could tell that uh, monster to attack your enemies and kill them and eat them and everything it would be so awesome if you could tame that kaiju you know if you could take it to places you know if suppose you you, you have to go to work okay next day so everyone is bringing their cars everyone is bringing bringing their bikes and stuff you know all that cool so called cool things you know and you will come with a fucking kaiju you know you will sit on top of his um, head or on his shoulder and this would be like this giant um, 500 feet kaiju you know 500 feet monster would be like do 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 you know it would be like do it would walk like this you know such sound will come you know such huge stomping sounds would come everywhere you know that do 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 and you know it will take your kaiju near your office and everyone will be like what the fuck is that shit so fuck what the hell man you where do you find this and i'll be like this is my friend here this is my buddy uh, i call him gojira you can call him gojira or you can call him ace or cloud or squall or anything you can you can name i, I don't know what i'm going to name him noctis perhaps i don't know or if that um, you know if that kaiju is a female you know then i'll i might name her i i might name it you know lightning or aerith or tifa you know anything i don't know or vanille or i don't know what i would name her. You know, I mean, could be anything you know mm i might uh, i think the best name for her you know if i have a kaiju if i have a monster of my own you know a pet monster a big huge monster i think i'm, I'm going to name her if that's a female i'm going to name her miranda that's the first name which comes to my mind i really like that name you know miranda and if that's a if it's a male uh, kaiju i think i'm going to name it mm i think i'm going to name it storm shadow no no that will be too much that will be too gi joeish or i don't know i think i think i'm going to name name it ed yeah that that would be nice you know simple short and simple ed hey ed then he will I'll, i'll call him like this hey ed what's up and he would be like you know like it will be like an echo and everyone will be like it will be so cool you know suppose you have a pet kaiju of your own and you're bringing it everywhere with you and everywhere and suppose you're bringing it to a wedding you know you're invited to a wedding and you're bringing it along with you and suppose it steps on the wedding <laughs> you know the place where the wedding wedding is taking place you know the whole building if it steps on it like <laughs> it would be so funny isn't it the whole wedding ah, it would be like ah, it will nuke it you know the whole wedding with its atomic blast or something like that suppose i have a flying cage you it would be so nice right it would be what would you like what kind of cage you or monster would you like you know flying or subterranean you know or a, a big a marine cage which can swim in the water aquatic type a flying type or a terrestrial type you know which can on land you know or all three how about a combination of all those things you know like a flying swimming you know, walking on the land you know 
Uh, you know, it'd be so cool, right? Just imagine, you know, I really wish I could have a keju of my own. Or, or, sup or suppose if any kind of keju invasion takes place and I could convert myself into a big mecha or something like that, like that you know. And I will fight that big keju, but, you know, it will be such a great fight, isn't it? But suppose I, uh, I get lost and I have this last weapon with me, that mind control weapon, you know, which I launch. Uh, the mind control ray of some kind I, lo I you know I blasted I blast the keju with that mind control ray and it becomes my friend that keju becomes your friend suppose you can do that suppose you could blast it with your mi with your mind control ray and it will become your friend you know and it will be like and you will be like yeah in total Japanese you know power rangers kind of shit hoo ha yeah that keju is now my friend. You know, go, go, Power Rangers. Anything. <coughs> okay, anyway, so what kind of keju would you like? A male, female, okay? Um, and what kind of, what type of keju would you like? Flying, aquatic, um, terrestrial, you know? And what would you name that keju? If you have a KJ of your own, and what would you do if any kind of um, invasion takes place in your city? If any kind of monster invasion takes place in your city, what would you do that time? Okay, um, please comment. Okay, like and subscribe this video. Bye. Take care. I might have something here for humans. Not much. What have you got in stock? Something of everything. A lot of merchandise comes through this station, and I snatch up the best of it. I'll be going down. You'll be back. What do you want? What's behind this door? VIP section of the club. For those with the right name. Do you want something? I'd like to join the party. This really isn't your kind of place. Afterlife's main floor has lots of drinks and great music. 